for cheat games, MSP or PSN money, check out my sponsor G2A, the link's down below in the description, and use the code RIG FREE for 3% off. What is up guys, Riggers here, and today we're a nice little train tip video for you guys, so if you guys can enjoy this video, and if you do, make sure you smash the like button down below, and also if you're not around here, please subscribe, so for this method, it's to have informed bronze players and also silvers, so for this guy on the screen, just going to be using him for an example quickly, so I paid 6800 for him, picked him up through bidding, and on the market for the cheapest one, I believe it's 15k, yeah, 15k in the second. So for him, gonna sum up at 14k and hopefully we'll sell for that price. And with bronzes and silver informed cards, it can sometimes take a while for them to sell. But if you pick them up at a good price, you should be guaranteed profits. So with these players, they're pretty good to trade with in my opinion. So for the first way, you can actually find these players in the search, put special, and then put 9,000 for the max price. Search up and for the ones in good leagues, just click on them quickly, click compare price, flick through the price and see if they're actually a pretty good deal. So for that first one, 9,000 bid at the second for the cheapest by now one, 35k from the looks of it. Let's just double check that for 35k. Yeah, 35k, so that one there, 20k. That one actually could be an okay one to actually pick up as well. So I'm gonna keep an eye on that one. But for him, at 9,000, the current bid, there's a very good chance he will go for a low price and you'll be able to make some profit on him. For the other players on this page, 6,500 bid on this uh, bronze guy. Only one other one up on the market, 13k. So if you can pick him up for 7k, 8k, you're possibly selling for like 11k, maybe 12k, so he could be okay. What league is he in? Actually, league, not really the best, but he still could have some profit with him. Next player, this guy, 4,400 for the current bid. I think that's a good price on him. Cheapest one, 16,000 sank, so uh, yeah, with him, he's in a pretty good league, so Football League 2, Football League 1, the Championship and Premier League, like bronze and silver teams, they're quite common, so... He could be a good player to keep you on. But yeah, this is one of the things you can do. Just put 9,000 for the like, max price, special in the search, and just click compare price on the players and see if they're a good deal or not. For the other thing that you can do, go onto Foothead or Footwiz, load up a list of bronze and silver English players who are in form, and just search them up on the market. You can also do this for ones from other countries, but for the English ones, they're sort of usually the best ones because like English bronze and silver teams, they're quite common, so they can be pretty good to trade with. So for Adam Armstrong just here, Need to uh, wipe out of the search. Let's check him quickly so for the price. All pretty similar, but all you want to do is search the players up and see if there's one worth sniping or one worth bidding on. And yeah, it's just no way to find good deals. So that is pretty much it for the actual way to find the players. So for this guy now, gonna list him up at 14k and I'll be back once he sells. Noble has gone to sell for 13,000 coins. So I did have to list him a few times. Originally list him up at 14k, then knocked him down to 13k, list him up twice that price. He did eventually sell for it. So with bronze and silver players, it does take a while for them to sell, but in my opinion, they're quite easy to actually make profit with. It's just like the selling process takes a while sometimes, but with these players, you should be able to make some profit. So that is gonna be it for this video now, so hope you guys have enjoyed, and if you have, make sure you smash the like button down below, and peace.